My grandfather is Carl Perkins. I am Carla Perkins, so I am named after him. That's my maiden name. Downtown, he would have been all over this. My name is Carla Simmons, and I've had the pleasure of being in downtown Jackson now for uh, 17 years. I've been here, and I've, um, I've been in business with Euphoria for 25 years. I opened Euphoria 25 years ago. Started it in Midtown. Saw great things happening and um, wanted to be part of it. I, you know, an energy um, downtown just possessed. I wanted to be inspired by the history, the charm, the stories. Starbucks was down here um, for a brief period of time and that was bringing me here because I was in Midtown. Well, I got a cup of coffee and I just decided to walk one day and I noticed um, that there were a couple of really cool buildings for sale. So um, that's where it all began. Began with a cup of coffee. When we first moved downtown, the general response that we got was, I haven't been downtown in so long, you know? And, and I guess we all kind of felt like that. People didn't have a reason to come here, you know, other than um, to come for uh, location for services. I mean, you know, it brought them here. I guess it reacquainted people with their city, you know, bringing them down to have a necessity like their haircut or their color. It reacquainted people with uh, something that had been lost. Our clients, when they're having their hair done here now, say, I love to watch life happening down here with all the windows and they're seeing people go to the gym and, and it works beautifully with the other businesses here. If we're not quite ready for a client, they just go visit Garner Blue or Sassafras or go to Grubs or they pick up lunch at Rock and Dough and necessity brings them here and then selectively they choose to stay here and finish their day and it just it's, it works great. It really does. Our clients have been really happy. We have gained a lot of traffic and business our business, making the move to Jackson Walk, was huge. It, it tripled our business. And the visibility is uh, incredible. It's been really incredible to be on this corner. It's been fun. There are so many beautiful places in Jackson. The city of Jackson is a beautiful place to live. But there is no place like downtown. The community, uh, the walkability, to just be able to walk the sidewalks and wave. Uh, I consider the other business owners down here my friends. You know, I live, I do life here. I shop here, uh, my clothes come from here. <laughs> this area, I eat down here, I do my grocery shopping here, I buy my gifts down here. People tease and say, do you ever go past I-40? And it's not often, I don't really have a reason to, but I love the blacksmith, I love rock and do. I love those. Um, I love, I eat lunch at Grubs almost every day. I've been Grubs two or three times a day. In fact, I told them they don't have to talk to me anymore because it's just getting repetitive. So. And my dinner every Thursday night is rock and dough. I'm pretty, um, we're pretty predictable. Yeah, the blacksmith, um, I have a favorite that I get there all the time and it's always good. Doze is so fun. I mean, how can you not go and eat a re at a restaurant that was the bus station? I mean, and with the garage doors up, I mean, that's just too cool. So, and right across from it is the Ned, which is amazing to go catch performances. Our local theater is just incredible. The funny thing that my dad and I talk about is how uh, Jackson Walk feels almost like vacation down here. It's fun. My dad said, I said, well, just close your eyes and pretend the ocean's around the other side of the farmer's market. It's like being at the beach. My favorite time of year downtown is the spring. And there's just so much beautiful energy with farmer's market and watching families and um, dogs. And it's just the walkability and the sense of community. There is no place like it. Again, I'm just ecstatic to be part of it and to watch it all happen. I'm excited to see people keep coming down here. You know, the stigma of, you know, you have to be careful or, you know, this or, all of those things have really dissipated. People are realizing that um, just go be part of it and you'll experience something completely different. You know, if you have reservations and you can't say that you've truly given it an opportunity to make a fair judgment if you don't walk it. Get out of your car, walk around and um, it'll change your mind really quickly.